Hi guys, welcome back to Practice Lab. In this video, I'm going to show you how to find the union of two lists using Java 8 Stream APIs. Okay, so let us consider these are the two lists and I need to find the union of two lists. So what is meant by union? First, let's understand what is meant by union. So union is nothing but the combination of all these elements. But if there is any element which is occurred two or more than twice, then that element should be added only once in the result set. So if you see here is the result set or union of this two lists. So you can see four and five has been occurred twice in these two lists, but it has been added only once in the result set. Okay, so we need to find this union of these two lists using Java Stream APIs. So let's get started and show you how to do this by using Java Stream APIs code. So here you can see I have written a class list union. And inside that, I have written a main method, which is going to be starting point for my program execution. Now, let me declare two lists, which are going to be input lists. So I'm going to use java.util.list. And then I'm going to make this list of type integer. I'll declare a variable to store the list element. I'm going to use arrays dot as list to initialize the list of numbers or the list of elements from problem segment. So I'm going to use one, two, three, four, five. This is going to be my first list. Same way, I'll simply copy this list and I'll paste it here. So I'll create another list and we'll rename it as list two. And then I'll copy the numbers which are there in our problem segment. So this is going to be my second list. Now I got both the lists. What I need to do, I need to find the union of these two lists and I need to use stream API. So there is a feature in stream. So stream dot concat. So this concat takes two parameters. First parameter is first stream and second parameter is the second stream, which we want to concat, okay? So here I'm going to use list one dot stream as a first parameter and then list to the stream as second parameter. So this will concat both this list and then I will get the result as a concatenated or combined list. Then I need to remove the duplicate elements from this result set because we want these elements to be appeared once only once in the result set. So here I'm going to use distinct feature or distinct function which is available in stream API this will remove the duplicate elements from the result set. Okay. Now I removed the duplicate elements. What I will do, I will simply collect all these result sets into a list by using collectors dot to list function. Okay. So this will give me the final list. And here I will declare that list of type integer and I will call it as union list. Okay. Now I got the result set. What I will do, I will simply print the result list. Okay. So here I am printing union list. Now let me run this code and show you how it is going. So here you can see the result set 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. It is printing all the elements from the both the lists. But if you see 4 and 5 has been occurred twice, but in our result set, it is only once. That means we have achieved the union operation of these two lists. Okay, guys, so that's it from this video. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. Also, if you need any assistance to crack the interviews, let us know at practice 23 at directgmail.com. Thank you. Bye.